There's a little docky down here. An exclusive union for the merchants of high uh, society. Alright, thanks for that game. Hello guys and welcome back. Welcome back to episode 15 of my Assassin's Creed Mirage playthrough. I hope you guys are all doing okay and keeping well. If you guys haven't been following this series so far and really want to check it out, there is a playlist on my channel with all the episodes so far, so do feel free to check that out if you are interested. If you guys have been following this series and want to show some love, does as always mean a lot if you guys like this video and subscribe to the channel. If you haven't already, subscribe to the channel, it helps, it really, really helps support me in the long run, so thank you to you guys that choose to subscribe, but equally thank you to you guys just for tuning in and enjoying the series with me. Anyway, it's, uh, anyways, we'll get straight back into where we last left off, and I hope you guys enjoy this episode. Cheers, guys. Okie doke, guys, we are back. Welcome back. Straight amongst it. The plan is simple. Enter the auction as a merchant wishing to bid on exotic artifacts. We know they want the hairpin. And we know they will be at the auction. They already let it slip through their fingers once. When the hairpin appears, appears I will watch the crowd and make sure to obtain it. That will secure a meeting with this treasurer. I am fully confident they will bid on it, whatever the cost. Yes. I will gather as much information as I can about this treasurer before the auction starts. For someone in their position, there will be no lack of whispers. Dark. The first feather without a head. It is your duty to find the right one. Do not let yourself get distracted. Focus on the mission at hand. It does no one good to linger on things that do not exist. This is real. I understand. Silence is better for the wise. And how much more so for fools? Havan Muvaffaran. Do you think we need luck? Oh yeah. What are opportunities gonna be? There is a rot in Karh, treasurer. Property stolen. Merchants extorted. Foreigners tormented. Corruption is rank and everywhere. But you are at its heart. Even now, your poison spreads along the East Road to lands untouched by the Order's venom. I hear you hunger for a hairpin. One up for auction at the Da'irat al-Mal. I will play the rival for your heart's desire. And draw you from the shadows. No, sir. Is that the night the treasurer? Cool. Into uh, some little kids scrapping. Welcome, everyone. By the way, welcome to episode 15. 15 big numbers. Pickpocket is for real quick. Game's the game. I still don't know how I sell stuff. Right, what opportunities have we got then? Guess we go in. Ooh. Oh, 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 into on the bazaar. There's this Donny over here. Oh, it's Kong. We use Kong to get us in. Liar! Should have known you would be here, Kong. Do you have any information about the treasure? The treasure? Hmm. I. What job do you have? <laughs> you see, little Finch, the Dai Irat Al Mal is not only an important event. Did someone take some a precious ceramic saucer? L <sighs> I knew I could rely on you, little Finch. You should be able to be right back. Okay, let's go get Kong's items real quick. He's probably just having a song to be perfectly honest. It all looted, and that's the gold ring. Another opportunities while I'm here. Oh, let's chat to this guy. Ahlan, Ahlan! Come upstairs and look at my words, ya sadiqi. Things you've never seen before in Baghdad. 
exotic Chinese artifacts. Here on! Don't be shy. Come closer and be amazed at my selection upstairs. Assalamu alaikum. You mentioned Chinese artifacts. Yes, friend. Welcome, welcome. You will surely find something of interest here. Longing for the exquisite, ya sadiqi. I have ornaments that hail from the Far East on auction. Rare vases, delicate teacups, but the hairpin is my prize. One of a kind, a beauty even the treasurer asked about. Wait, the hairpin? Where is it? It's going to be up for auction. If you wish to purchase it, make sure to bring a good bag of coin. A hairpin from the East? This must be the item El Kululu was after for the treasurer. I must look out for it at the auction. Okay. We got a clue. Let's keep it. Uh, keep it pushing. Da, da, da. Oh, just fully decked that guy. This uh, must be the stall Kong mentioned. Now to find that plate. Buried it up yeah. here somewhere, I think. Um, <laughs> no, we need to be tactical with placing it. God, I just ate loads of burgers and I feel uh, pretty damn ill. Oh. Ah, I see. Hello. Yeah, it is. Where the hell am I? What was the purpose of that? Get Kong's items from Luca. Where is this Don then? Saying I've got to go in here, and I've got to make my way up there. I see. So I've got to drag this. And then. Pull it through. Got ya. See, I can be big brain. No, I can't. Yeah, I can. How has this guy even got up here? How does that make any sense whatsoever? Just to hold a plate like this. Now maybe he will tell me what he knows about the treasurer. Hmm. Suspicious activity on the rooftops. Is this suspicious activity? Yeah. Uh. I don't know what it's on about. Maybe it's just saying something to do with the letter I read, I guess. I'm just gonna go back down. Oh. Hold on. See you later, son. Back. Off with you. Turn the plate to Kong, where is he? Looks like everyone. That works. Okay. It's not something the treasurer appreciates. I repeat, the treasurer. Not something we can rush, yes, say that. The treasurer will not be happy. Neither will I. I know that. The perfume creation is complex. We are already doing our best. Your best is not enough. Come. We talk as well. There. there are ears in the walls. That woman mentioned the treasurer. I should keep my ears close. The treasurer is fond of the Kinar, as you know. 
No one is more unhappy than three dozen bosses go missing. It's a hard one with holding life supplies. Reduction has been slow, yes, I have done. I always get sidetracked with all the different options, like I don't know which one's the best. I should go back to Kong, but just keep following these peeps. See what's going on. Oh, there's a nun. Wow. So everyone was meant to be or can you get nun that uh, nuns? Nuns in Muslim faith. They're very uncultured, so. You are not telling me exactly what it is we are missing. The uh, blood, my lady. The blood is essential in the scent. It is what makes the Kina perfume special. We must have it. I will talk to the Khalifa. See what we can do. The treasurer will have to wait for her supply. This perfume on the tax collector's letters. I thought it smelled like iron. Was it blood? This woman could be... Assalamu alaikum, ya Sayyidati. Wa alaikum assalam. I could not help but overhear, Sayyidati, about the perfume. It is not courteous to eat. Seeing as you are an admirer, you are pardoned. My name is... It has a unique scent. Rose, honey... Blood. I should have guessed. Blood is born from iron, is it not? But because of that detail, it proves difficult. If it is so exclusive, it must be popular amongst officials. I think I caught a scent of it near the treasurer. Ning uses the Kina. She is quite taken with its rich mystique. Curious. You do not... It is unwise to judge someone, but... Indeed. Basim. Basim. I must not waste any more of your time. So, the treasurer is a she. And her name is Ning. Ning. Babylonian jewelry. Here he is. Here. Little Finch delivers. Who I thought this. It is now. <laughs> I was having my usual I afternoon tea steal it. when I overheard two ladies speaking about an order they fulfilled for the Dayadat Alm. They made a beautiful robe for the treasurer with in Eastern wear. The treasurer is likely a foreigner from the east. The auction should be starting soon. Okay. We'll move to the auction then. Got all deck. Oh, that was close. Got a bit trigger happy there. Let's move. Uh, I pickpocket you, sir. Need all the good stuff. Power favor token. Oh, yes. Loads of rich people here. Makes sense. Durham, we take it. That's what I need. I'm pretty poor right now. I'm gonna be honest. Ah. So next to this. Oh, it's her. Marhaban. Assalamu alaikum. Yasas. Nihao. Hello. Nihau. It is the time of year again to fulfill your deepest yearning, to listen to your heart's desire, and purchase what God has shown us. It brings me Where's great joy to welcome all of you esteemed individuals to our annual Dairat al -Mal. First on our exclusive, captivating list of exotic odds and ends, we have a stunning statue from India. Made of ivory and crafted by the finest artisans, it will be a perfect addition to any home. Oh, mm. what do we have? One bidder already? No, two. Calling once, twice, a third. Would anyone like to best that price? No? So, this piece goes to the lovely lady. Is it going to be her all along? Next, we have a one-of-a-kind ethereal beauty. This hairpin hails from the east. Wow. And look at the detail on the dragon. Perfect as there a collectible. She is. And even better as a gift for a certain lady friend you might have. 
So, so what is this piece worth to you, Ya Azdekhai? One for the treasurer who graced us with her presence. Ning, the treasurer. Two. Let's go sauce some ago while she's buying. Mm. I'm. Oh, poo. I don't have any money. Sold to the man over there. Kindly collect your item from my associate after the auction. Now, moving on. And we I'm thank sorry, you once poor. again for making the Dairatul Mal a success. May your purses be ever full and your heart ever longing. I wish I could I have, have to get the help from that man. Why would the treasurer want it so badly? Hey, hey. Who's this guy? Just. What have I got? I hear only members of the Merchant Guild can arrange an audience in her chambers. Only my eyes can he do. So, what is up here? Maybe if I found out where she purchased her robe or her beautiful fan. Found him. Now to quietly borrow the hairpin. This beautiful hairpin is mine. But for fools, they stood no chance against me. The face. Ah, you have the chance to see that again when I present her with Intricate this gift. And beautiful indeed. Ah, let me take a look at the hairpin again. This is nothing like these oh, like ancient a... objects the Where order is, is seeking. <laughs> That was so weird. Name. Literally just fully finessed. The game's the game at the end of the day. That's why you've got to keep them in your pockets. You know? Can't be walking around with your phone. That sort of thing. If you're running, do I quick pocket? Still. Um, what's Ning saying? How about this is she? I have an appointment with the treasurer. Move aside. Apologies. My instructions were clear. No brooch, no entry. Do you know who I am? I need to speak to the treasurer. I was called. Summon. Assalamu alaikum. On what business? I have a gift for the... Only members of the ivory coin are allowed. You again. I have a gift for the truth. only members of the Right, I'll get a little brooch thing. Okay. Merchant's Guild. Look, see? With respect, that does not entitle you to three bags of saffron, two of vanilla, and a bottle of honey without a single coin. Impossible! Bah! This is a waste of my time. Hello? Trouble with cousin. No more than usual. These people from the The Ivory I Whatever you know. Well, the ivory coin is an exclusive mer How do you obtain I hear only respected. They think their status. This is expected. Hello, spices for you? Okay, I think the ivory coin broke from the guild. Oh, thank you. Another scholar token. No brooch, no entry. Oops. Oh, what? Is this guy good? <laughs> right now, where do I need to go to get this brooch then? I mean, there's a little docky down here. An exclusive union for the merchants of high uh, society. Right, thanks for that game. I should have expected this to exist. The Chamber of Antiquities is the treasurer's haven. I need to find a way in. Sleep. Go to sleep. Thank you. Thank you. This must be the ivory coin's brooch. 
Dragoon. Shiny, I have both trinkets. The guard will have to let me in now. Lovely stuff. We did it. Didn't take me too long. Oh, I hate that you can't run. It's so... It's just taking me about 10 million years to get around this place. I'm getting stunlocked by NPCs. Ah, uh, let me run, please. While we're here, actually, we'll quickly do... Um, we'll quickly do a... So we've got a level 4 that we can do. So we've got that, we've maxed. Uh, that, I feel like it's pretty damn useful. So do that. Rock with that for now. God, let me run, please. Can I like dash? No. Thought maybe if I like dash forward, it'd be a bit quick, you know? Get looted, son. Assalamu alaikum. You again. I have something that she wants. Very well. Here he is. Nice. This way, Sayyidi. I have been looking forward to meeting the treasurer. It is an honor. Indeed, Sayyidi. She is busy, and her time only allows for a few rare appearances. I have never seen so many treasures in one place. God, that guy's built. I've never seen so many treasures in one okay, place. We are back. Oh, I don't really know how to do this. I might need to reload again. One has to be careful not to get bitten in there. Please refrain from speaking about the treasure inappropriately. Go, you may enter. Okay, we did it. That was really odd. You are a new face. My name is Basim. New to Baghdad, but not to trade. I deal mostly in fine antiques and collectibles. You must have a good eye for detail, then. What have you brought me, Basim? You know what I brought. A man not to be toyed with. Come, show it to me. She's gonna get wrecked. Rookie mistake. Exquisite. Ever seen something like this? So perfect. So delicate. No, but I am surprised that you have not. I do have a pension for them. When I was but a child, my sisters and I would tie our hair with sticks, adorn them with stone. I pretended they were the rarest gems. We had nothing, but we felt that we had it all. There are many reasons why people see me. For advice, a taste of power, and most often, to win favor. Why have you come, Basim? Just As a you. fellow collector, I have heard much about you from others. Your extravagance, your taste. I wish to learn... Did they say I was lucky? I loathe the word. When I first arrived in Baghdad, I was one of many seeking my fortune. Now... I have even the East wrapped around my fingers. I clawed my way here where many gave up, preferring to spare their nails. But me? I don't mind a few scratches, a bit of blood. Surely there have been connections. The people you met that helped you get to where you are. No matter what others say, you only have yourself. No one else. Ah! <laughs> 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 
Get wrecked. How does she know? She's just gonna kill me randomly. She just thought it was a trade that she could finesse. Wait, what? Everything prospers when family is harmonious. Family? The word has no meaning. The notions, even more so. Only the self hears the deepest whispers of your soul and accepts you whole. No one lives alone. But we die lonely. In the end, we are absolutely, simply, truly alone. How is she speaking? She's got a stab neck. I know she's dying, but it's besides the point. Here she comes, a Ginny. Ginny Weasley's rocking up. Get out of here. No way out of here. Uh, get me out of here. I'm a celebrity. Get me out of here. What are you going to do? Shoot me? Do this. Son. Oh. There's one. He's gone. And pulling away. See you later, son. Right. Get out of here real quick. Ooh, chest. Is this how we get this chest? Question mark. Maybe it is. Ah. I knew it. This is night bagger. Ooh. Right, so let's go see what these guys say, and then we'll wrap up the old episode. Basim, how did you fare? The streets are alive with talk about the auction. Rumors spread quickly. It was this woman, Ning. A woman holding the reins. She must have angered many. Angered and enthralled, in equal parts. It is no wonder she kept her identity harsh. Now the upper echelons of affluent louts are soiling their silk robes, wondering if they are next. The order will not stop here. If they have reached the east, then there is no telling how far they will spread. Did you see it? The Jenny? It... Uh, it is gone now. It is gone. Rest while you can. Our work is not done yet.
There he is, just a random bloke. Hokey doke. Well, guys, what I'll do is wrap up this episode here. Uh, once again, thank you so much for joining me on this one. But yeah, I'll let you guys get up, get off, sorry, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Cheers, guys. <laughs>